Locrian stands in front of the temporal gate, his face close to its surface, his eyes scanning its inner frame. He slides his finger down its side. Metal or stone, he thinks. It's hard to tell. Whatever it is, it's as cold as it looks. The psychological effects of its presence manifest a personality, ominous, menacing, yet alluring. He presses his palm against the side. A subtle vibration? It's hard to tell. Oren stands at the gate's side next to the panel and observes Locrian's curious behavior. Do you have any questions about the temporal gate, Locrian? Without moving his eyes from the gate, Locrian responds, I have lots of questions, but I assume you won't answer all of them. Oren grins. That's right. What would happen if someone stood in the gate's frame while you turned the dial? Would a door still appear? A door would still appear, Oren says. It would then occupy the same space as the person standing in the gate's frame. Locrian's brow furrows. He takes a step back from the gate. In this density, that would not be a pleasant experience for the person standing in the gate's frame. Idris shakes his head, his face full of discomfort. How far can someone travel with these gates? If the user knows the correct calibration and coordinates, there is no limitation. Locrian's face contorts in disbelief. It takes light more than four years to travel from Alpha Centauri to Earth. Are you telling me I can travel that distance in one footstep with this device? Your words travel and years allude to separation and time, illusory concepts that only appear to apply to reality. Those are just two among many illusions in this density. I'll just pretend all that makes sense, Locrian laughs. Oren grins. Any other questions, Locrian? So this thing basically defies the laws of physics. How was your group able to build such a thing? No one physically constructed the gates. They are simply thoughts, imagined by the one intelligence existing within seventh density. Use of the gate should assist you in realizing how superior the unlimited law of seventh density imagination is to your limited perception of third density's so-called physics. Locrian laughs. <laughs> it takes a lot more than thoughts to create something, Orin. Zova-6 wasn't just created in my mind with imagination alone. Between concept and reality were years of hard work and time. Oren grins. You only believe such a thing because the hard work and time you speak of are part of your memory. Memory may seem to be a physical process encoded by so-called structural molecular changes and connections of so-called neurons, but in truth, memory only exists like the rest of your conscious experience does, within your mind. And mind, Locrian is the instrument of imagination. 